I'm Sebastian, naturopath and biochemist. Breathing masks will be the hipster beard of 2020. They can be our ticket out of this lockdown situation. There are two different types of breathing masks. The more fancy respirators and surgical masks. Respirators are reserved to medical staff only because their availability is currently limited and they are quite pricey. Surgical masks have the advantage that they are cheaper plus they can be made in a textile format. And textile mask will be the hipster beard of 2020. I know this already and you will see I'm right. However, there are issues with both of these masks because they get wet when you wear them and you can only wear them for four hours and then you have to change them. Also, both of these types of masks are single use only and they produce a lot of trashes. Another issue with these masks, and I will demonstrate that on this surgical mask, is when you put them on, you need to make sure they sit tight. And it's known that all of these masks are to a certain extent leaky, so your air is the air that you're breathing. It's not only coming through where it should be, but also to the sides. And this already is a reason why breathing masks cannot offer 100% protection. Remember what I said in my last video. Coronavirus spreads via the hands and via the air. Infection occurs mainly via exhalation from infected people. That means via breathing, speaking, coughing or sneezing. In all these cases, virus particles are released from contagious saliva into the air by forming drops, smaller droplets, and aerosols. Both respirators and surgical masks are able to filter out droplets and drops from the air. However, only the respirators are able to also filter aerosols from the air. However, there's a study on SARS-CoV-2 showing that if an infected person is wearing such a surgical mask, this reduces the emission of coronavirus particles tremendously. And for this reason, it's really important that we are all wearing breathing masks because you cannot know if you are actually infected or not. So if you're wearing a breathing mask, you are protecting others. There are more additional benefits from wearing a breathing mask, which is that you are protected against direct splashes of contagious saliva if someone is sneezing or coughing directly into your face. Furthermore, because you cannot touch your nose or your mouth, it's much less likely that you will get infected via your hands. And if you are wearing such a breathing mask in the public, you are constantly reminded not to kiss and hug when you are greeting someone. If everyone was wearing such a breathing mask, that could be actually a game changer. It's clear that wearing a breathing mask and even this simple surgical mask will help to reduce infections via hands and air tremendously. Because breathing masks are rather protecting others than yourself, wearing a breathing mask means social solidarity. One thing is very important, because these masks cannot offer 100% protection, it is really important that you stick to physical distancing, that means distance to others, one to two meters, best two meters, that you are washing your hands regularly, and that you make sure, before you're putting on the mask already, that your hands are clean. This is for protecting others. So. If you put on the mask and you go to the supermarket, you make sure it's tight. You go out of the house, you do your things, do your shopping. And then when you come back, you need to make sure you're not touching your mouth. Already outside, but this is clear, you shouldn't touch your mouth and your nose anyway. So you're not touching the mask. And when you come back, you take the mask off 
and then it goes to the trashes. Or it's a textile mask, reusable, and it goes to the washing machine. It needs to be washed at 60 degrees to make sure you can use it again. So having a couple of textile masks is definitely beneficial because it takes some time until you get them washed and they dry again. So in this spirit, please wash your hands regularly, wear a breathing mask in the public and practice social solidarity. Music